Hi guys, this is Serena from CF Power Scripts. In this video, I want to show you what you need to do if your opt-in page doesn't record your contacts, doesn't record your leads. It can happen that, for example, your funnel shows up opt-ins, but no contacts are being recorded, or your funnel isn't submitting when a user clicks the submit button. There are a few reasons why that can happen, and in this video we will cover troubleshooting for them. So the first reason, and also the first possible solution, is that your submit button is not set properly. That's the most common reason why the contact information wouldn't be properly collected and submitted to your autoresponder. To fix that, you need to open the page in the ClickFunnels page editor, click on the button that you have on your opt-in page, click Set Action, and make sure that the action of the button is set to Submit Order or Submit Form. When that's done, save your page. The second reason why your opt-in page doesn't submit any context may be that you're using some custom code on your page that interfere with the submission. To check that and eliminate this problem, go to the settings, go to the tracking code, and check if you have any code in header code and also footer code, and if so, then remove it. After that's done, click X to close the window. In addition to that, check your page and make sure that you don't have elements like that, custom JavaScript and HTML, and if you do, then remove them as well, because they may interfere with the submission of your page. Save your page and retest the submission in an incognito window. And before we jump to the third possible solution for your opt-in page, I want to point out that if you sometimes feel that the default ClickFunnels features are not enough and you would need more functionality for your funnels, then feel free to check out our Sea of Power script solution. We offer a lot of features that you can easily add to your ClickFunnels funnels just with few mouse clicks. For example, proper Facebook conversion API tracking, click magic tracking, professional integration of Vimeo and YouTube videos, Google Analytics, LinkedIn tracking, email validation, different kinds of free capture, and so much more. And the best thing is that a lot of those features are available already on our free plan. You can find the link in the description to create your free CF Power Scripts account and start improving your funnels already today. But let's go back to our opt-in page. The third possible solution why your contacts are not being submitted is an incomplete integration of your autoresponder. To check that, go to the settings, then go to integrations and see if you have the proper integration of the email autoresponder here. If there is currently an integration connected, go ahead and click Remove integration. Once it's removed, your email integration settings should look like that. With your email integration removed, save your page and retest the submission of the contacts in an incognito window. If the page doesn't submit or the contact isn't recorded in ClickFunnels, continue to the next possible solution and if the page does submit, Go ahead and re-add your email integration and test again in incognito window. If the page submits, but the lead doesn't appear within your autoresponder, please contact your autoresponder for further assistance. The fourth possible reason why you're having troubles with your opt-in page is custom form field. If you have custom form fields on your page, for example, like that, it's possible that one or more of those fields could be interfering with the submission. What you need to do for those fields, go to the settings and check the custom type of the field. Make sure that this field contains no special characters and that it has just simple numbers and letters. If it marked as required, make sure you fill it in when testing your page. Review all of your custom fields and make sure that they are named properly and doesn't include special characters and that you use just simple letters and numbers. After that, save the page and test your funnel in an incognito window to see if it works from there. And the fifth possible reason why your opt-in page is not working as it should and the solution to that is using mobile and desktop only fields. Of course, you can use different elements on desktop and mobile view. 
to make sure that your page also looks nice on mobile. But there are some elements that you should only have one of each on the page. And those elements are select product 2.0 email input, which is really relevant for the opt-in page, credit card form and button set to submit order, which are more relevant to the order form. And if you have a mobile and desktop version of these elements, make sure to merge them into one. For example, if you have an email input here and in the settings you set it to desktop only, and then the second email input you set to mobile only, this may interfere with the submission of the contacts on your opt-in page. So make sure you have only one element which will be set to all. For that you should go to the settings of the element and instead of desktop only or mobile only choose all. After you checked your elements make sure to save your page and test it in an incognito window. If none of those solutions didn't fix your page then you can reach out to the ClickFunnels support and see how they can help you on that. But those were the most common reasons why your opt-in page in ClickFunnels doesn't submit the contacts. And in most cases, these troubleshooting steps will help you. Don't forget to check out CF Power Scripts to add additional features to your funnels and see you in our next videos. Bye-bye.